I don't mind a bit of controversy. I think it's a challenge. I was exposed to science at a young age. My parents bought me a microscope when I was really little. I really enjoyed having it. I killed a mosquito to get hold of some blood and I had a look at blood cells as my first specimen. And that exposed me to the science field that I'm doing right now. I'm doing my PhD in chicken egg white allergy. Simply, I'm trying to produce a hypoallergenic eggs for egg allergic patients. For my PhD, I'm collaborating with CSIRO, the biggest government science organization in Australia. It's fantastic because it gives me a lot of opportunities for my future career. My actual research involves a little bit of genetic modification work. It is a um, controversy because in many countries, GM is not accepted among some people. But unlike normal GM projects, we are simply changing bad proteins into good proteins. So we have something better from a bad thing. I came to Australia when I was about 17 years old and I was not independent at all. I was spoon fed. <laughs> I was sad by leaving the family. But on the other hand, I was looking at my own life and I thought if I come here and reach my dreams, I'll be able to just live happily after. I was never exposed to the real world until I came to Australia. So studying at Deakin was really helpful because we were exposed to work applications during the undergraduate courses. When it comes to job applications, employers look at the experience you have. So I'd say Deakin courses have an upper hand. And when we graduated, we were not scared to go into the world because we were already exposed to it. In my entire family, I was the first one to pursue a career in science. Everyone else did IT, law and business. My dad always wanted me to become a doctor from a younger age, but I chose not to. I wanted to do something else, but at the same time, I wanted to make him happy. So I decided to do a PhD that would also give me a doctor title. Doing a PhD was a controversial decision, but it's what I enjoy doing. And at the end, my dad is proud of me. Thank you.